Hello everyone, I really wanted to do a very very quick video for my users. This is again, if you're a security expert, probably this video is not going to be helpful to you. <clears throat> but my users, if you're especially a Mac user, Microsoft just released a security update and mainly for the Mac users. And if you look at it, they have released updates, a security patch for five uh, important vulnerabilities which are 2020-1193, and 16855. And if you look at it, why they released it and they did not wait for the next patch Tuesday, they say availability of the security update for Microsoft Office for Mac. <clears throat> so most of the most of those vulnerability the fixes uh, a remote code execution vulnerability, like you see three of them. Uh, 1193, 1218, and uh, 1338. Three of them are remote code execution vulnerability, which is very, very uh, uh, important and critical usually. And then we have one, 1124, that's information disclosure vulnerability. Uh, and the other one, 11855, is also another information disclosure vulnerability. So five vulnerability, and they have uh, updated the rating as important. So they are probably recommending, hey, don't you, don't wait till next Tuesday if you can. Uh, please go ahead and update these uh, patches. So these vulnerabilities are now fixed. So there we go. Go ahead and download the patches, especially if you are using Mac and using the Office products. Uh, go ahead and please uh, evaluate your risk and get the get the security patches as needed. So what I wanted to do, quickly go to a couple of these and uh, uh, check out uh, how they look like. So this, for the first one, I'm already in here. Okay, that's 11931. Uh, if you look at it, they all released, they all, all got released last week uh, with the regular past Tuesday. Okay, uh, sorry about that. Uh, so here, if you look at it published, that's the original publication date and uh, today it got updated okay so this security update addresses the vulnerability by correcting how microsoft excel handles objects in memory okay that looks like an important one uh, you can read more about the exploit exploitability assessment is not yet publicly disclosed uh, as as per microsoft there is no exploitation known uh, and then uh, latest software release how likely that it's going to get exploited less likely and uh, that's about it so here uh, this page let's go to one more page come back over here I'm going to get uh, one more and I'll give you links to these vulnerabilities where you can go study some more and uh, decide on your own and get the patches uh, if you want to be uh, if you decide to install it okay this one is the another code execution vulnerability Okay, again, it will say same thing, but this time this security updates the vulnerability by correcting how Microsoft Word. So last one was for Excel, and this is for the Word and how it handles files in memory. Okay, again, the same stuff here about the same ratings, publicly disclosed, no, exploited, no. Uh, latest software release to uh, exploitation is less likely, and uh, a denial of service, no, that's not applicable. All right, so that's about it if you are a mac user again uh, please evaluate your risk and uh, since microsoft is recommending them as an important update i would also recommend just please go ahead and update your office systems office environment and just be more secure thanks for watching and have a great day